So today I thought I would let everyone know that I had the most riveting conversation today about my friend Andy and how he wants to eat his firstborn baby. So we were, you know, coming up with ideas of how to do this. One idea was that he could be sitting there outside of his wife's vagina with two pieces of bread. And when the doctor asks, Mr. Barrera, what are you doing? with these pieces of bread. He could say, waiting for lunch! And another way was, he could shake the baby till it dies, throw it on the grill and say, I don't know what happened. A weird man came in and started grilling my baby. Gave him a third degree. Play on words there. I didn't know if you actually picked up on that. People take me too seriously. What was another thing? Oh, I said what he could do with the dead baby was take it to a taxidermist. Because how awesome would that be? Just like walk in with a dead baby like, hey guy, I want you to stuff this. And then another thing that he could do is make it like a yo-yo. Or like a, a marionette. Maybe even like a ventriloquist dummy. That'd be funny. <laughs> and it uh, sounds like a good idea. Someone tweeted me a question. Hold on. Okay. They tweeted me. What was your most embarrassing moment? My most embarrassing moment was... Do I have to just pick one? I would have to say... My most embarrassing moment was in first grade. They had like these dinosaurs and sauce things, which was like... Chef Boy ID, only like... Ghetto and like for elementary school kids. And, um, threw up everywhere. I was allergic. I didn't know that. So I had it a second time. The same thing happened. But I'd been feeling sick all day, so I thought that was just it. Had it a third time. They stopped making it because so many kids were allergic, and I was the one who had the most severe reaction. Got sick every time. So, I think that's the end of this, but I'll leave leave questions and leave questions on my tumblr too oh my God. why am i so weird <laughs>